get counter, you, your fourth throw, you, you shouted loud, you were happy, what was it? Uh, actually, it was for a long time, it was a pretty good performance for me and also emotionally really, really big throw for me. So to beat uh, my good competitor, Sultan Kovago, in the last round on his hometown, so it was a very good emotion. Yeah, are you getting things right towards Barcelona now? Yeah, like actually so far I was a little like uh, behind my schedule, like a little bit tired. So I had like a few days uh, rest before this meet and uh, actually in the warm-up I felt pretty good. Competition started so and so, but I really could put together on the last throw all my energy and uh, yeah, 68 plus it was, it was good, good uh, performance. So this city uh, can be put on the list um, 60 plus? Yes, definitely. <laughs> I saw your statistics on your website. Um, you do a lot of statistics on it. Yeah, we have some good friend who's really into statistics and he has done really crazy stuff. So we just came out with uh, very detailed statistics about especially throwing events. And you can see everything about cities, uh, different countries, different people. So if people have time, just check into it. It's really interesting. Uh, we saw also some Spanish cities on it, but I didn't see Barcelona at 60 plus. You didn't throw there or you didn't get 60 plus? Uh, actually, I haven't competed in Barcelona. I've been competing like uh, Sevilla and uh, Madrid, but not Barcelona. It's, it's my first time. So you think, uh, because like Sevilla, Madrid, you think Barcelona will have a good win? Uh, I think definitely it's a good place to throw, so actually my coach's uh, best performance in Olympics is made in Barcelona, so I hope to keep uh, this good spirit there and win there. I saw also you have like a, something like a hundred thousand throws in, in like seven years or so? Uh, yeah, like uh, I've been doing like usually like 10,000 throws a year, so it's been a lot of throws. How many throws did you do today with the warm-up and, and, and the competition? Uh, today it was actually only nine throws. <laughs> and how many of them were good? Uh, half of the throws were good, so 50%. <laughs> and, um, the, the fourth throw was good, what about the, 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 which other one was good? Warm-up throws were also good. <laughs> uh, let's get one more time back to, to Berlin. Do you have to make something up in Barcelona for what happened in Berlin? Uh, yeah, like uh, it was big disappointment for me in uh, Berlin. So because so far I was doing really good, and uh, when I didn't really hit my potential there, so my long-time goal actually has been to throw over 70 meters in championships. So I hope to make my dream come true in Barcelona. And you have to beat Harting, yeah. I have to beat anybody because it's really strong field this year. Like uh, Kovago is good, uh, Harting is good, Malhovsky is, is very, very good, and you never can count out like uh, Alekna. And uh, so it, it is really strong competition this year. So I think to win you need to throw over 70 meters. As, uh, also, some other uh, athletes I spoke to today, they did really good performances and they, they, they pointed it like it is a team event here and that helped. Yeah, of course, because uh, I came here as like a captain of my team and uh, and on the paper I was one of those who really needed to bring like 12 points home. So I didn't really want to let my team down, even like probably we're not going to make it to the next year on first league. But still like I made my performance and helped my team. So it was, I think it was a good support for my team. Even if you maybe won't make it uh, in, in this league, were you a good captain? I hope so, because we had really young teams, so many people were competing in such a big competition first time, so it was hard to expect that we really make good, but, uh, but yeah, we have to try to fight back to here, so it's not going to be easy, it's easier to stay in, but, uh, but we have to fight.